What's going on everybody? James here, redoptionagency.com, 22 years selling full-time on eBay. And um, I didn't want to make a video because it's kind of short and I woke up late. But um, I'm going to show you some stuff I've noticed that there is a difference between two accounts on eBay. Um, this is my big account, 58,000 items. Right now we're going on noon. I've got $57 in sales at noon on my 58,000 store. I will refresh for you and show you again. $57. Let's go to my new store. My new store, $49 at 12 noon. Refresh for you to show you, $49. So almost identical sales on each account. This one has 500 items, over 500. The other one has about 58,000 items. Next, I'm going to show you. There is a difference between search engines. Motley Crew, and I typed entertainment or death CD and we get this declutter one okay this is the new account you can see the new account is spot on everything in search is working perfectly Motley Crue all the everything's where it's supposed to be you go to the new account you search the exact same thing get the same item and you have the problems you see it's over here, pre-owns over here, sellers over here. Don't even say the seller's name. So there is definitely, both accounts are being totally treated differently. Um, whether that's on different servers or not, that would be my guess. I'm not 100% sure, but there's definitely a difference. Now, if this is, the problems are happening to old accounts, probably most of the eBay accounts, even shoppers on eBay, have old accounts. So how many of them are having messed up search results because of the problems? And how deep does the problems go? Is it more than just this? So clearly, two totally different search results when you search. And what can you say? And about the exact same amount of sales when you got totally different amount of items. So yeah. So now I think this kind of is just showing the proof between uh, the uh, what's going on with eBay. Each account is being uh, is reacting different, is acting differently with the older accounts being the ones that are getting left behind and having the most majority of problems and what have you. So how can you have the same amount of sales on two different stores when you've got 500 items in one and 58,000 items in another? Well, I just showed you the reasonings why. They're not the same accounts. They're not being treated the same. They're not acting the same. They're not showing the same results in search. Two totally different worlds. So. I just want to put this out there to kind of show everybody who everybody keeps saying, well, I'm not having any problems, so there must not be any problems. Well, this, I think, clearly shows that there are problems on some accounts, but not other accounts. So um, just another little thing, opening up separate stores, just opening up more eyes of problems going on. So and how seeing the separation and the differences of, between them. So thanks, everybody. I'll see you all in the next video.